to reduce the number of cogs I need by moving that over. Do do do. Let's see about speeding this one up. Let's see here. To do that. What the hey? Not gonna. It's, there's ways to make this way more efficient, I'm certain. But. Yeah. Woo. This is 256, and we're using... We're probably using it all. 128, that's half. And then 64, yep, we're using all of it. So really, we won't... If we hooked something else up to this, we wouldn't have any more, any more rotational energy. So we need to keep that in mind. Anyway, now that we have a mixer try throwing items into it let's do uses ah i see heated is there any that don't need to be heated because that's going to be an issue hmm No heating required. Oh, we can make andesite alloy this way. Good to know. Eye crust. Dough. Tomato sauce. Aha, I see. Let's do the andesite alloy. Ooh. Yeah, we need to deal with the heating step. But... We've got iron, and we've got this, and if we throw these things in there, is it not gonna... Is that not a, a recipe? Maybe it has to be zinc. Maybe it has to be zinc for the mixer. Getting some fast travel would be nice. Flight would be nice too, but we're a long way from that. Alright, so we have some zinc. And then once we figure this out, we'll look at our advancements tab again and see what the next thing we learn about create. Likely a windmill, because we're going to be out of rotational energy with all of these things hooked up. Mm. 
Alright, so if it's supposed to be zinc, like has to be zinc, let's see here. Hmm. Is this too close? Maybe it needs a space, like this has a space above it. Maybe it comes down and spins. If that's the case, we could... We move you. Um. Up one. That is still in the same spot. that space that seems like a pretty big space hmm that doesn't look right I need to understand how this works. That's what I need. Is this too far up? That's what I want to know first. Maybe I should bring up pictures. Um. It's... Images, please, because <sighs> all right. So, what I'm seeing here is where I had it before was the correct spot. Is it out of rotational energy, maybe? If we take you off. That should be a valid recipe, right? Um... Get an andesite, and we wouldn't take it with the iron nugget. Uh, 
<sighs> so why? 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 I don't know why. It's not saying that I've got it wrong. Maybe try a different one and see what the heck's going on that's not heated. Automated, lots of shapeless crafting that we can do. I just need to see how it works so that I can... A bowl and two tomatoes. We could have a bowl. Oops. And two tomatoes. Let's try that one. There's our bowl. There's our tomatoes. Let's see what this one does. game just is so stuck. It's... Oh, it appears this mechanical mixer is not rotating with enough speed. It needs to go faster. That's helpful. I didn't notice that. How do you make it go faster? Um... Yeah, how do you speed things up? Do you need to speed this up, or is there a way to make this go faster? Um... None of this is going to be really helpful, I don't think. Because this is the only two size cog wheels there are. There are. Um... I don't know how, if there's a way to speed it up. And there's blocks. So, do we need something more than a water wheel? We may need to use learn how to do the windmill if that'll make things spin faster. Okay. Windmill bearing. Windmill bearings attached to the block in front of them.
Okay. Amount of side blocks determines its rotational speed. Great. Does direction matter? All right, what do we need for you? I need a turntable, stone, and a shaft. The turntable is any slab and a shaft. We need to make some shafts. Okay. Let's learn about windmills. What do you need? Okay. Um, so, do we want to put it up high or do we want to make it like spin? I guess it's gonna chop us up. <laughs> um, it might be. I don't know if they have collision boxes that we need to worry about. Don't know. Um, let's put it here so it's not right. It's in the same area, but it's not connected to that power. Do 10 high. And if I jump up, it's going to be the wrong direction. Now, sail parts connected to it that had just any blocks. So if we did this as like the root, the bit of the windmill, and then we need to do what it said sail. Do they actually make sail? Ooh, there are sails. Sail frames need the andesite alloy. Sail. Well, we could do that. We've got sheep, and each recipe makes eight. Does it have to look like. It looked like it was attached to trap doors? Let's make another shears that sink. Let's get some wool. Um, five. I'd like six, please. Seven's fine. But let's see what we can do here. make two sets of frames that gives us 16 sail blocks and I need to get up there and if we do here okay so I see
Hmm. Okay. The, is there a way with the wrench to rotate them? Hello. Okay, so we can do that one and then we probably need to rotate it or something to get the other ones, don't we? Thank you for the offer, Bombang. Okay, so if we... What did it say? If we right-click you? But you won't turn until... Yeah. But if we put these on, they're not going to go the right way. Ooh, that might help. This seems really silly. Maybe it's not the right way. Because to me, a sail would be flat. Apparently that somewhat works. So I think what I want to do is if that's how you place them that way, get them to what actually is their f they look like a windmill to me, I would need to place um, them this, this way, no? Let's try this. I really should just grab some cobble from our cobble gen here. And if we do... Let's get up here and we're gonna get rid of these sails. And if we did... Start with that. OK. 
can we now place them? Oh, this isn't where I want that, is it? Because this is the... I want it back here. I should go down and get the other sails. No. Hmm. Why did it work there? Let's see if just going down would help. Can I, when I face you? Yes. All right then. We'll get it eventually. There's four and four, so then we just need to do this side. Take a fall. No. Oh, sheep are laughing at me. Okay, and then we need just to do this one. That looks nicer to me if we go right click it what happens let's eat something there we've got 1024 that's more than the 200 and 56 from over there. Um, how do we increase its speed? So the stress capacity is great, but what we have going on over here with the mixer is that we need to make it go faster. That's what I'm wondering. Hmm. Let's see here.
apparently you can uh, I'm looking at this with flywheels you could do a large one next to a small one Let's see we can get this guy rehooked back up um Let me read this again. You can step it up by placing a large cog wheel input diagonally to a small cog wheel as the output. Okay. So... Technically, if I did that's fast. Ooh, I even got an advancement for it. So then for this one, I would need to do the same thing. Give me that cogwheel. All right, so then for this, um, Can you do Can I put you there? Will you work? That's what I'd like to know. gearbox and then okay so what I'm seeing here so I can get to hook you up that way. Um, yeah. I see. All right. Mm-hmm. 
Alright, so that's faster, but we need to get it to rotate. We need to... So that would be using a vertical gearbox. If we were to put that there, and that there. Ha ha! Now is that fast enough? It's fast enough! Yay! We did it! <laughs> It just took a lot of tinkering to figure out how this works. Let's we'll celebrate with some tea. Alright, so now we can mix things without heat. The reason I said it's going to be kind of a problem for getting the heater is that I think we need to catch a blaze. And we, that means still trying to find a... Um, uh, this and a, a fortress which we hadn't accomplished last time we were in the nether did I get the windmill working? the windmill is working it's not hooked up because I figured out how to increase speed by googling So I've got enough speed for the mixer here, but I, I, I've got a little windmill. Just a little one. I can add more sails, but that's all my sails right now. Um, so yeah, goes faster this way, which makes sense. It's just it's not a mechanic that I know much about. So understanding increasing and decreasing speed like this is uh, new. But yeah, getting a burner. I'm wondering if that's what we're gonna have to do next. Because in order to make alloy, we're gonna need to do this. And yeah. Um, this, don't know what it does washes things. Okay. Let's try to do... What's the next one we want to... What's the next advancement we want to attempt here? pocket crusher we should maybe put down a pocket crusher that will that help us get double ores double the um uses or is that for things that aren't that gives us one hmm Washing that gives us slightly more. Aha! So, just trying to maximize. We're still working on trying to maximize our mining input and output. <laughs> and so, I'm learning how to do that. Um, you're welcome to share that in the Discord channel, Darkwing, on, in my Discord channel, that's cool. So, it does appear we're going to want to do this crushed variety. This is the big crusher. Um, we're going to want to do that. Uh, what are these called? They're these crushing wheels. They need they need the advanced 
crafters before I can do this. So I think step one is doing the small mill. So let's make one of those. Andesite alloy, wood, stone, and a cog wheel. All right, so how do we hook you up? And I think what we might do is not hook it up at this this here. We'll hook it up. We'll need to get power from up there down here. So we'll have to make a bunch of... Um, we need some more than the two little cogwheels here. We're going to use the big and the little, so we need to make a big one, which I think needs four. It needs four of the other ones, right? Oh, no. There we go. Okay. Now if we go up here, we need a... We need to turn the shaft so that it comes down. So I actually probably need a vertical um, gearbox. Make it vertical. And okay. And then this hooked up to the gearbox with that coming down. Now the question I have is, can we put multiple gear boxes on this sh shaft and have it go different directions? <laughs> but we now have power coming down. It's not very fast. But it's down. And then we have this guy. How does this guy hook up? Let's see. There's the wheel, so we need to have it go. We need to turn this again. No, we don't. Because um, we can just do... Yep. All right. Hello! Increase the number of sales will increase the speed. I think it increases the rotational energy. I don't know. I don't know. It's it's worth wondering and they're not expensive. There's our little baby mill.
Hello, House of Dogus. Okay, a windmill is a windmill bearing or mechanical bearing and wool or sails. Any block can be attached to the front of the windmill bearing, but only wool and sails will produce power. The wool or sail can be placed in any configuration and shape, does not matter. Super glue is needed to detach blocks together. Sails will connect together, um, to, will connect to each other and other blocks that have already been attached without needing super glue. Um, yes, the rotational power does go up based on the number of sales. Um, are you working on the create portion of this pack? I'm currently playing with create, yes. Um, is there a particular goal in mind? Learn create. <laughs> My goal is to learn and understand create. So it does create um, the stress units, but it also gives you RPM based on the number of sail blocks. Um, RPM is rotations per minute, which I'm assuming translates to uh, speed, because that's, yeah. So we need more sails. Um, we could use wool if we had super glue, but sails are just wooden sticks, or sticks and wool, which I can do. <laughs> so let's do some more of those. Um, let's do that many. and see about getting those added. It was really finicky getting them added, so I hope, I, I would love an easier method. Um. I have no idea what super glue requires. I just know that sales don't need it. According to the wiki, if you wanna use if you want to use wool, you need super glue. Yeah. So, um, how do we connect you? Can we do one, two? This one. Uh huh. Thank you, Darkwing. I appreciate it. So then this one should be here on this side. And then that one should be on the top. What are we gonna do with these last few sails? Where are we gonna put them? Because now they're even again. We have eight, so we have two more per side. We could do that. Sure, that'd be cool. 
and let's go over there. Might have been easier to do this, uh, yeah, on the ground. There's no such thing as free Minecraft, there's only stolen Minecraft. Alright, so we have just doubled the amount of sales. Yeah, and we've doubled the amount of stress units. Um. It looks like it's going faster, too. Yep, it's going 40 instead of 16. 